Hey, I'm Royal and I'm gonna give you my three best tips that the best Zoe players use to dominate in the new season. Zoe is currently one of the strongest champions in the game if played well, so pay attention to the following tips to play Zoe like a god. Zoe can extend her first ability's range by ulting or flashing, but everyone already knows this. But what I see a lot of Zoes do wrong is using their mobility spell and then using their first ability. What you want to do is use both instances of your first ability and while it's traveling to your opponent use your ult or flash. This makes your first ability unpredictable and harder to react to. Use your ultimate to reposition so you can land your third ability. You can use it to dash right on their face to easily land your third ability or you can use it to reposition around the minions so that they don't block the path of your bubble. A very advanced use of your ultimate is to position near a wall to extend the range of your third ability. Your first ability can proc your passive twice. Use your first ability, then auto attack, then you use the second part of your first ability and you can auto attack with your passive again. This is great for taking down turrets and for early trades. Speaking of early trades, Zoe's level 2 power spike is insane. Check out these clips of how easy it is to catch your opponents by surprise. Trade aggressively level 1 to set up the level 2 all in. Use your ignite and flash to get your second ability's damage off and try to pick up their summoner spells for even more second ability procs. Your first and second ability with your passive, electrocute and ignite do a lot of damage this early into the game. If you enjoyed the video, like and subscribe for more Wild Rift content.